Alicia Hildebrand joins us this morning to talk about the Winkler Arts and Culture Center, a whole slew of things that you guys have planned over the next little bit. But uh, beginning today and uh, coming up on Tuesday, you've got something that uh, is going to be a whole lot of fun, and you're featuring artists from right here in the Pemina Valley. So tell us a little bit about what you got going on. Yeah, also the rest of the month of March, we have our photography exhibit um, featuring local photographers uh, from all areas of types of photography. So we have portrait and nature and event photography. We also have some film um, and then we also have some architecture as well. Yeah, that's cool. Uh, and sports. So um, some of the names are Herb Cool, Ian Peters, Walter Duick, Terrence Claussen and Ryan Swatsky. Uh, and also Kevin Dreger. Um, they are all coming out to share their portraits. I, I kind of will leave the suspicion of what, yeah. who's doing what um, to your eyes when you want to come in and view them at the center. Um, yeah, all month long, just check out the website for their operating hours. Um, they are a little different than maybe what you might have come to in the past. Um, but yeah. What uh, can we expect from Tuesday as far as the reception goes? Like, is it going to be kind of like an evening event? Or are we going to be able to meet the artist? How does that work? So on the 14th, we're having an open reception for the public to be able to come in and meet the photographers, hear about their stories of... Uh, kind of what's behind the picture and uh, their journey in order to get these pictures um, and what kind of led them that way. It's really just a mingle night. It's nothing too formal. We're not going to have any presentations and stuff. It's a come and go idea. Um, it'll be at 7 o'clock on uh, Tuesday the 14th. I don't really have an end time because sometimes these things just kind yeah. of end on their own. Um, but we do want to make sure people have the opportunity to come out. So, uh Come early, make sure you get that time in. Also, there'll be a cash bar as well. There you go. Uh, you don't need tickets for this. It's just come out and have some fun. Uh, when it comes to things that you've got going on at the Winkler Arts and Culture Center, where do you, like you've been on the job for three months now, where do you, where, where do you come up with your ideas for what you want to show, right? Because it is all about making sure that the community is a big part of this. Yeah. So, I mean, of course, it's a planning committee that we have behind the scenes that kind of tries to prioritize what we would like to see in the gallery um, coming through. But really, it's, it's what the communities want. Um, and so this is why that participation from the community is important. So when you do come in, um, there's always going to be an opportunity to write your suggestions, um, share your thoughts, either with myself or the volunteer. Extend what you would like to see in the gallery because we want to be able to build the centre around a community initiative, right? So um, being driven by the work that the community is doing, whether it be in the arts, uh, whether it be from newcomers in the community, from other parts of the world, um, whatever kind of comes our way, we're going to we're gonna take that and we're going to be able to uh, build programming around the needs of our community. Which is what it's all about. Uh, you can check out all the details uh, by heading over to PeminaValleyOnline.com. Um, Alicia, thanks for dropping by, talking to us today, and good luck for Tuesday. Yeah, thanks.